So we make a lot of videos with plans to make more, but me and Thing's computers are getting quite full of video files, so in today's video we will be turning this Asus A88XM from the last video into a NAS. So let's get started. For this we are going to run true NAS booting off this Intel Optane SSD. Now because we're broke we can't afford a Johnsbo N1. The thingy's broke ass got this from Ikea and cut some holes in this piece of plastic to screw the motherboard into. For the boot drive, we are going to use an Intel Optane SSD plugged into a USB NVMe adapter in the USB 3 port. Now we can boot up TrueNAS to see that everything works perfectly. In the future, we plan on adding a 10GB NIC to the system and some SSD storage. But for now, we are going to use the built-in 1GB NIC. The four hard drives are going to be running in RAID 5, giving us 12 terabytes of usable storage. So now we are going to throw all this crap in Thingy's cupboard to get started. We are going to mount a fan on the bottom of our case, then we are going to screw the plastic sheet and the motherboard down. Now let's place all of this in Thingy's cupboard. The hard drives are going to sit on some eraser to try and dampen vibrations from the hard drives. Now we are going to test performance. Let's write a 111GB file to this NAS and as we can see the 1GB Ethernet is clearly the bottleneck. Hopefully in the future we can upgrade to 10GB Ethernet. Now let's look at the power draw. With the drive spun up, the system uses about 100 watts at idle and around 200 watts while transferring a file and booting the system. Changing the motherboard to power efficient mode seemed to make no difference at all. And that's that. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.